this morning as the North Central College Chaplain, it is my honor to ask a blessing over these proceedings. While I will lift up my prayer from the Christian tradition, I hope the words and thoughts might resonate with you, no matter what faith path you may follow. May we enter an attitude of reflection and prayer. God of the past, you are the source of light and truth for the world. We thank you for the countless moments in thousands of lives that have brought us to this time of celebration. For the generations of yesterday who have poured themselves into this place, for the family, friends, teachers, and counselors who have raised and guided this class to become part of the North Central College family, bless their continued work and the love that it shows. God of the present, you surround every moment of our lives. We now gather to celebrate the accomplishments of scholars and athletes, to celebrate the tenacity of student veterans, first-generation college graduates, and premier scholars, to celebrate the vision of artists, actors, and activists, to celebrate seekers of truth, doers of justice, and lovers of kindness. Bless our time today as we honor them and send them forth. God of the future, you have revealed light to all nations for all time. As we remember and celebrate, we also ask that your light continue to illuminate those gathered here, trustees and administrators, faculty and staff, family and friends, that we might continue the work of North Central College embodied in this graduating class. And finally, gracious and loving God, pour your blessings on this graduating class of 2018. They are prepared to graduate, to succeed, to serve, to go out and transform the world for good. Shine light and truth on them every day that they may do well and do good all the days of their lives. Everlasting God, I lift this prayer to you in the name of Jesus Christ, who lives with you in the Holy Spirit. Receive it and multiply these thoughts and prayers for the sake of those gathered and for a world that needs bold bearers of truth and light. Amen. Thank you. Please be seated. Thank you, Reverend Doolittle. And thanks to all of you for braving the weather this morning. At the May meeting of the Board of Trustees of North Central College, we transitioned to a new board chair. And the retiring board chair mentioned to me this morning that after nine years in that role, that this weather had never happened under his watch. I think he refused to give the number to the new board chair as to who to call to rake in the request for the sunshine. Thank you for braving the weather to be here. To all the family members and friends here today, to the trustees, alumni, faculty, and staff of North Central College, and to the distinguished members of the class of 2018, welcome to the commencement exercises of North Central College, one of the finest comprehensive colleges of the liberal arts and sciences in America. I'm pleased that all of you are here today. During this academic year, 670 students completed requirements for bachelor's degrees and 83 completed requirements for advanced degrees. Class of 2018, you've experienced one of the most transformative periods in the history of this college. We modernized our facilities to improve your academic experience with new classrooms and science labs a new Bloomberg Finance Lab, additional places for meeting and studying and by updating the technologies, a new residence hall, redesigned walkways, more parking, and more options for gathering and eating were also part of the plan to make the campus the best that it can be. At the same time, members of this class were undertaking their own efforts to make this college the best that it can be. You helped establish forums and clubs that promote better communication and celebrate diversity. You welcomed speakers and authors who expressed diverse viewpoints. You modeled civic engagement and showed respect for others, 
representing the highest ideals of ethical behavior. You've made North Central a better place through your positive leadership and conversations on social justice, inclusion, and race. Also notable, the class of 2018 is the first to experience our Cardinal First program for first-generation students. Many of you were part of the pilot program in 2014, and then you became active participants and leaders. We're proud that 130 first-generation graduates and their families packed Wentz Concert Hall yesterday for the pinning ceremony. Also in this class are the first graduates in new academic programs, including environmental studies, neuroscience, and the Scheimer Great Books School. Some of you played a role in our celebration of the 50th anniversary of WONC, sharing your pride in its special history and alumni. Our Enactus team was one of the top 16 in the whole country, and many of you garnered important recognitions for your excellence in forensics, mock trial, debate, and the Chronicle. You've shared your music and theater talents on our fine arts stages, enriching the campus and Naperville community with concerts, plays, and spirited performances at athletic contests. You've volunteered thousands of hours on campus and off, helping with Feed the Need and human service programs locally, nationally, and internationally. You've studied abroad, across the globe, and across disciplines. You partnered with your professors on research. Yesterday, we toasted the accomplishments of 22 college scholars. You've embraced sustainability by gardening, composting, recycling, riding Cardinal Red Bikes, and learning about solar panels, leaving this campus and the world a better place for your actions. The student athletes in this class achieved 19 CCIW conference championships and five team national titles raising our institutional total to 35. You represent some of the first members of the men's volleyball team and women's triathlon program, and you contributed to the success of both. Among you are 17 academic All-Americans and 11 All-Americans, and some of you were honored multiple times. But most of you chose to be student athletes simply because you are, enjoy competing and building camaraderie with your teammates. We're also proud of the seven United States military veterans receiving their degrees today. Each one of them has overcome a unique set of hurdles in life to earn their degrees today, and we congratulate all of you. In the class of 2018, we have 13 countries represented by our international graduates today. They hail from Bulgaria, Chile, Colombia, Croatia, El Salvador, Germany, Japan, Macedonia, Mexico, Rwanda, South Korea, Swaziland, and Uzbekistan. And I want to welcome the family members who traveled from these countries to celebrate with their graduates today. I'm proud to add that three of our international students will be staying to pursue master's degrees at North Central College in the fall. Graduates of this class are going on to earn advanced degrees in a variety of fields, preparing to become pharmacists, nurses, physician's assistants, occupational therapists, and other health professions. Others will pursue advanced degrees in statistics, chemistry, ministry, Spanish translation, sports administration, music theory, leadership, energy management, and business administration. Your destinations are as wide-ranging as the University of California at Santa Barbara and the University of Florida. Some of you are beginning positions with reputable institutions like PwC, Allstate, Blue Cross Blue Shield, and Edward Jones. Many have found teaching and coaching positions with area school districts. 
Your class represents the ideals of this college's founders, and you have been worthy role models for the students who will follow in your footsteps. And I look forward to hearing about your successes in the years to come. North Central College is an independent college governed by a self-perpetuating board of trustees, which includes representatives of many professions, alumni of the college, the Naperville community, and the United Methodist Church. Many of our trustees and their families are here today, as well as members of the Board of Trustee Associates and the Alumni Board. They join me in welcoming all of you to this 153rd commencement. One very special guest here today is the Honorable Steve Cherico, Mayor of the City of Naperville, the finest small city in America. Mr. Mayor. Good morning. It's an honor to be with you all here today. This is my fourth commencement ceremony, and I have to say, as mayor, I attend a lot of events, but this is one of my favorite events. To always see the students, the graduates, and the pride in the moms and dads as they watch their students cross the stage here uh, gives me hope and confidence that our future is in good hands. And I know with the world-class education that you've received, it is in good hands. I have to say that as I talk about Naperville to other mayors, I mentioned that you know Naperville's a college town, and I mentioned this last year, but it always surprises me that the other mayors are surprised by that. They, they look at me sort of puzzled, and they, they don't realize, they don't make the connection between the two, and I, I say, how could you not know this? I mean, our, the campus is right downtown Naperville, the stadium is, is right in our downtown. And it struck me that the reason why is because of our students. You don't treat Naperville like it's a college town. You've treated it like it's your hometown. And for that, we're very grateful. You have really enriched this community with all you've done. And so now it's time to go out and enrich the world. So thank you very much for, for all your hard work and for treating this town so wonderfully. Good luck. <laughs> 